it is Friday around 6 p.m. Welcome to a new vlog. We're just in the car. We just went to shoot a look after Dylan was done with work. And now, oh, you want me to pay for it? No, I, I can it. pay for it. I got it. Okay. It's 32.13. Okay, we're not ready to get out. We just shot a look. I shot my Prada dress that I showed you in last week's vlog. I shot it with my white shirt underneath and I still need to edit the photos, but I think it turned out nice. And now we're just gonna go to one of the thrift stores that we like. Um, we haven't been since it reopened and maybe there won't be too much of a lineup, hopefully. And I've also lost my black beret and I originally got it from there. So I'm gonna see if they have some to replace the one that I lost. And then tonight, we don't really have any plans other than we bought a cider. Is a cider from Normal Beach? I think so. Yeah. So we're gonna have a glass of cider and we'll see. Friday night. So we didn't end up going to the thrift store because the lineup was too big and it's too cold to wait outside at this time. So we just picked up some dinner and then we're gonna go back home. Good morning guys. It is Saturday and it's about 11.30. I got myself ready. I'm gonna show you my outfit in a second. It's a beautiful day outside so I wanted to go for a walk and maybe go to a couple of thrift stores and bring you guys along with me. Um, I haven't found good things in thrift stores um, since they reopened. I think it's because they have a lot of the things that they obviously didn't sell throughout the pandemic and all that so I keep looking and if I find anything good I'll let you know. But other than my pair of jeans that I showed you from um, in last week's vlog, I haven't really found anything good. So I'm going to go um, and walk to two or three thrift stores that are kind of near our apartment. And then I'm going to get some coffee because the coffee I made this morning wasn't good and I didn't drink a lot of it. So now I feel really tired. I need a little boost of energy but I just want to get out the house as quick as I can because it's really nice out it's supposed to be 10 degrees today so um, I'm probably overdressed but I feel like walking there if there's a lot of wind I'm gonna get chilly but anyways let me just show you my look so I'm wearing my Burberry reversible wool coat this one is really light it's not lined so I feel like it's a nice transitional outerwear piece and then I'm wearing this polo vintage black cap with a cashmere um, hoodie underneath this costs fanny pack but I'm wearing it as a crossbody my a goldie jeans and some black boots I would have wore my Margiela trainers right here but they hurt my feet at the moment so I need to wear these boots but I feel like it would have looked so much better with these trainers so just imagine this outfit with these shoes <laughs> and i'm just wearing this cap because it's really sunny outside and i just want to protect my skin um because at this time of the year i usually get a lot of freckles and i tend to get sunburn without like noticing it when it starts to get sunny and and um warmer so i just want to stay protected so Let's go get a coffee and then let's go shop a little bit. Hey guys, I'm back from my thrift shopping. I think I walked for like 40 minutes or an hour and I did pretty much all of the thrift stores all around um, the neighborhood and I found one piece. I feel like I've gone really picky with 
thrift shoppings and the things that I really, really want to bring into my wardrobe and that are going to get a lot of wear and kind of really bring something special to what I already have, what I already own. So I feel like I'm before I used to thrift shop and buy a lot more, but then I realized when I clear my closet then that those are the pieces that I want to get rid of. So now I'm trying to be really picky and really um, choose items that will really um, stand the test of time and that will bring something special to my wardrobe mostly. And I found this really beautiful mohair sweater. I didn't try it on but I'm sure it's gonna fit because it's quite oversized and it's in this really nice melange knit as you can see there's a little bit of gray there's a little bit of red some black and yeah i thought it was really nice yeah it has like those balloon sleeves a little bit and it's a very basic shape but um those kind of knitwear you can't really go wrong with i thought it would look really nice with a white shirt underneath with the collar kind of peeking out and then some leather pants because it's quite round and it's very thin it's sort of like see-through a little bit i can tuck it into the pants and it would look really nice so i think i'm gonna try that on maybe later or tomorrow and uh potentially shoot it so yeah pieces like this i know are a great value uh, because they're so unique and you can really only find them in thrift stores and buy shopping a lot in thrift stores so I found that. I was on a hunt for a pair of thick cotton sort of boxer shorts. It's like boxer shorts for men but for women. Like for the summer I think it's really nice. It's like pull on thick cotton shorts that you can wear with a baggy t-shirt or even knit like that and some slides. Um, and I didn't find any. And also I was looking at leather jacket, leather pants and nothing really spark my interest so yeah it's still good to to go though and see what's out there and go often so you can kind of make good finds in the end so I uh, for those who are interested in the places that I went to today I went to 96 years vintage which is on Bloor if you live in Toronto you'll know where it is and then I went to Siberia vintage which is a little further east on Bloor as well and then I went to Rare Find I think which is close to the Valley Village at Lansdowne station so I did these three uh, vintage stores usually 96 years has the best selection and I wasn't really in the mood to go to like a Valley Village or something really big I kind of wanted a more quiet shopping experience because I was shopping by myself Dylan is busy with work today so yeah, I went to those three thrift stores and I found something. Most of the time I don't find anything, but sometimes you um, get your hands on something rare and unique. So I was lucky for that. So that's it. Now I think I'm just gonna maybe go for another walk. It's still really, really nice out. And wait for Dylan to come back so we can have our cider. Yesterday we bought a cider and we didn't drink it at night because we didn't really feel like it but tonight since it's really nice out we might drink it at home or yesterday they just announced that the patios were opening outside and since, since it's such a nice day we thought maybe go for a glass of wine on a patio somewhere so guys i just steamed the sweater to kind of get rid of anything i mean it looked pretty clean but before i try on my thrift purchases I always like to either give them a wash or steam them depending on <laughs> sorry <laughs> depending on if it's knitwear or something that can be washed easily and I love it I love it so much let me put you a little further away so you can see so I styled it with this white color shirt from Uniqlo it's just a little too long I wish I had an oversized shirt that was just a little bit shorter because the hem isn't perfect but I love the fit of this sweater I've also put my hair up in you know with a clip at the back I think it looks good and I'm wearing my leather pants with it I think it's a really cool outfit very kind of 
casual, perfect for a date with Dylan on a patio. I think I'm just going to wear my puffer on top so that it's nice and warm. And footwear, I think I'm going to wear maybe my big Prada creepers with black socks. I'll let you know what I choose for a footwear. I need to touch up my makeup too because I haven't really put on much this morning and I feel like I need a little bit more black. There was a wait list at the wine bar that we wanted to go to. So we're just sitting in a park and we went to get some Korean cold noodles. I'm just about to eat them in the park while we wait for our table or spot to be ready. guys it's about almost 10 o'clock and <laughs> we're back from our wine date and now we just got our sushis delivered and we're about to oops, dig into it it looks delicious I'm sorry if my white balance is really yellow right now but I don't really feel like filming this clip again so that's gonna be it bon appetit Good morning guys, we just finished shooting my new sweater, it's very sunny and beautiful today. We also went back to the thrift store that we couldn't get into on Friday and we didn't find anything. So uh, now we're just gonna eat a little bit of lunch, we brought some lunch with us in the car and then I think we're just gonna try to hang outside as much as we can today just because it's so so nice I'm only wearing a sweater I took off my coat because I got hot when I was shooting and yeah that's about it beautiful Sunday hey guys it's <clears throat> much later I've been a bad vlogger today as in I didn't vlog <laughs> I'm just picking up my camera just to update you on what we did. We um, walked a lot outside just because it was so nice. I um, took my photos and then we came back home. We had lunch. And then now we're just unpacking the groceries. We're just finishing unpacking them and we're going to cook dinner. It's been kind of a slow Sunday and I really didn't feel like going grocery shopping but we did it I'm glad we did it and we're just preparing ourselves to uh, do a load of laundry very exciting things so Dylan is starting dinner I think we're gonna have some um, pork katsu sandwiches we weren't planning to have that but we had some leftover in the freezer that we needed to eat so that's what we're gonna have so I think I'm gonna film a little bit of the process of just making it <laughs> and the result hopefully it's gonna be good I'm in the mood for it and yeah I think tonight we're just gonna watch some Netflix I started a new K drama it's okay not to be okay at first I didn't really like it just because I couldn't really get into the story but now I'm pretty I'm pretty into it so I think I might watch a couple of episodes of this and just call it a night very quiet evening my hair is a mess I also need to wash my hair so maybe I'll have a bath and I'll try to sort out my hair
happy Monday. It's what time is it? I feel like every time I want to say the time on my vlog, I never know what time is it. It's almost 11. I am fully ready to get out the house. Today is a beautiful, beautiful day. It's supposed to be 15 degrees almost. Sunny, there's no wind, so I'm taking this opportunity to go downtown by myself and try to shoot with my tripod. Um, yeah, I'm gonna show you my look. I washed my hair this morning and then I put on a little beret just to flatten it and then I kind of liked, it reminded me how much I miss wearing a beret. So I got inspired um, to style a look with it. So I'm just gonna show you what I'm wearing real quick and then I'm gonna head out. So I'm wearing this black uh, vintage beret with my little trench coat that I showed you in my previous vlog from W Concept. My little bag that I also showed you <laughs> from W Concept. And right now I'm just wearing these boots to get there just to be a little warmer, but I wanna shoot the little white Mary Janes that I received from W Concept. Let me show you real quick. So I've just put them in this little bagu bag because I'm gonna use this as a prop, I think, to shoot. But here they are. They are so cute, very minimalistic, which I love. They're all lined in leather. These are really, really good quality and yes, tragedy i've broken a nail <laughs> so it really bugs me when i film and i see that it's shorter but anyways let's just ignore that um so yeah i thought with this trench it would look really good because the color is really close and it's kind of monochromatic so i'm just gonna pack these because they need a little bit of stretching and i don't want to do a lot of walking with them so i'm just gonna pack them and wear my comfier boots to get there and hopefully I'll find a quiet spot to film a reel and shoot a couple of photos. Hey guys, I am back home as you can see. I came back a while ago and I've just been doing some work, answering some emails that I didn't have the time to do this morning. And yeah, I shot everything I had to and I had a nice lunch break with Dylan which was fun and now it's still really nice out and I really feel like going for a walk I spent the whole day on my phone and my computer and I kind of need some fresh air but also I need to edit this vlog so that it goes live for you tonight and I'm kind of debating if I just take take it easy from now and go for a walk while it's still nice out and while it's still light and just postpone the edits of this video for tomorrow morning which would mean that this vlog would go live on a Tuesday instead I'm sure you guys wouldn't mind I'm just used to upload my videos on Mondays and usually I get it all done in one day but I just don't feel like being on my computer for so long so yeah I don't know what I'm gonna do I might just go for a walk and and see if I have time to do both but we'll see maybe this vlog will go up a day later and I hope you won't you won't mind it and I hope this vlog is interesting either way I think I'm gonna end the vlog now just because I don't have much else to do for the day except maybe going on a walk and starting to prep dinner so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this probably short vlog and thank you so much for watching again and I hope to see you in my next video bye